Yo, yo, what's up everyone? Hope everyone's having a great day. Today we have a very exciting video. As you guys can see in front of me here, I have every box of football cards that Panini has made for the 2022 football draft class. So what we're going to be doing is opening all of these boxes, comparing and contrasting what they have to offer. And at the very end, you guys can comment below what your favorite product is. Then also comment below what product you feel as if performed the best. So we're just going to kind of nosedive right into this. It's probably going to be a longer video. We'll start with Prism Football since it's the most recent product. And um, it's probably the most collectible out of all the, the you know, all the, out of all the boxes that we have in front of us here kind of shimmy this down so you guys can see better we'll kind of just go one at a time so we're going to start with prism football this is the walmart boxes to offer the red white and blue prisms on the side here's all the randomly inserted cards that we can pull pretty good amount of stuff there aren't any numbered cards but you can pull autographs if you guys haven't already make sure to get qualified for the giveaway i'll put the link down in the description below that you guys can click that'll lead you directly to the giveaway me a moment here we're giving away five awesome prizes again i'll have the link to the description or a link to the giveaway video in the description below giving away all three of these football blaster boxes we're giving away a sky b cards hot pack and a sky b cards t-shirt so make sure to get qualified for the giveaway without any further ado we're gonna like i said we're gonna start off with prison football and at the very end, you guys will comment below which product you feel as if performed the best and which product is your favorite personally. So fingers crossed we can pull some bangers. Everyone say a prayer to the card gods and let's get active with Prism Football. Starting it up with Keenan Allen. We do got a red, white, and blue of Greg Dulcich and a rookie of Isaiah Pacheco on the back. So you definitely want to be looking out for him. Out of all of these products, I know Prism offers Pacheco. Rookies and Stars does as well. And I believe Donruss Elite, but that's it. He's a pretty tough rookie to pull right now. Obviously, we're still looking for Brock Purdy, Kenny Pickett, and any of the other top dogs. Uh, oh, we got points right here. <laughs> All right. So we have Tristan Wirfs, Cole Komet. We have 900 Panini points. Wow, that's not bad. There's the code if anyone wants to try to snag that. So... Prism starting off pretty strong. I'm not a big fan of points, but 900 is a pretty good amount. So what we'll do at the what we'll do is we'll save all the pulls for each box, and then at the end we'll do another recap. Oh, we got Sean Taylor, red, white, and blue of Maurice Jones, Drew, and Devin Lloyd on the back. We'll do a recap of all of the hits that each box had to offer. It feels like it has a jersey card in it. Um, and you guys can comment below which product you feel as if did the best does have a jersey card we have falk jj watt romeo dobbs this dude's been following me lately we have arnold on the back prism starting out strong got a jersey card 900 points what was it we got a pacheco rookie as well we still got two packs to go we got leonard fant Jameis winston and rookie Jalen Tolbert on the back. And for our last pack of Prism Football. We got a silver. We got Jacecki, Deuce McAllister, silver of Donald Driver, and James Cook on the back. So Prism did not disappoint, honestly. Kind of <laughs> overperformed. Uh, so we'll put all the base cards out the way. And we'll save all the hits. For Prism, we'll come back to that box at the end when we do our recap. I actually haven't opened any of this product, so now we'll move on to Donruss Elite. I never once reviewed this product at the beginning of the year. I didn't anticipate that I would honestly be opening much of the 2022 class. We've been spoiled the last two years with all the uh, rookie quarterbacks. This year wasn't as strong of a class, so... We get six packs in each box. What can you pull in here? You can pull numbered cards and you can pull autographs. So that's always a good sign. And I know you can pull Purdy in here. Let's see what we're looking at. We got Tannehill, Patty Mahomes, Justin Herbert on the Spellbound. I've never pulled one of these cards. And Aaron Rodgers on the back.
All right, J.J. Watt, George Pickens, rookie. We've got a star status, Aaron Donald, and a King Henry on the back. I'm liking these cards. The design's pretty simple. Cards look clean. We've got a TB12. Got something super shiny. Oh, it's number two. It's upside down. We have Antonio Gibson. We have a David Bell numbered out of 499. Kind of has a kaboom type design to it. Jameis Winston on the back. All right. So Don Ross Elite producing a numbered card. Surprising. Moving along. We got Kamara. Travis Kelsey, We've got a Joe Burrow on the Spellbound, and D-Hop on the back. Then for, oh, we still got two packs to go. We've got George Kittle, Britton Brown, full throttle of Gabe Davis. It's a cool insert. And Tua on the back. And for our last pack. We got Michael Parsons, Joe Mixon, T. Higgins Green, and Kadarius Tony on the back. All right, so that's going to do it for the blaster of rookies and stars. Didn't really pull too many hits, but we did get a numbered card. Can't really be upset with that. Let's move on to probably my favorite product. My favorite product to open this year is either rookies and stars or Zenith. Mosaic was really fun too. It's going to be tough to knock Mosaic out. But yeah, people are commenting down below. They're pulling RPAs from these. A lot of autographs. Tons of autographs in these blasters. Here's the sides of the rookies and stars. Tons of stuff you guys want to pause and check it out. Hopefully we can do pretty well. I've actually had really good luck with rookies and stars this year. I pulled a pretty good amount of autos. Haven't pulled any like big names, but you can't complain pulling them. We got Scary Terry, Derek Carr, Montgomery. We got a backwards card. Is this a? It's an autograph of Jeremy Rucker. Man, these I always get trolled with the Jets rookies. We got Jeremy Rucker number thirty-one of two ninety-nine. Pull this dude all the time. This dude becomes the truth, and I'll be able to retire. But hey, rookies and stars coming out hot with a nice auto. Moving along here, we have Cortland Sutton. Red. Um, Joe Mixon, Man in Motion. Drake London on the Stellar Rookies checkerboard. And Matt Corral on the back. All right. Let's keep her moving. Got Danny Dimes. Pretty good amount of base cards in this product. We got a red of Debo. Saw the 49ers helmet, got excited. Standing ovation Debo. Kenny Pickett on the draft class. And rookie Samori Tori on the back. Nice little Kenny Pickett rookie. Got Gibson. A lot of base. We got another backwards card. So this should be a numbered card. Ooh, it's 49ers. Let's just flip it. Three, two, one. We got Drake Jackson. It's a rookie, too. We were that close to pulling a numbered Purdy card. So we have Drake Jackson numbered 73 of 80. Rookies and stars coming through big time. We got John Elway, King Henry, uh, Dotson, and Aiden Hutchinson on the back. So that's what Rookies and Stars does, man. If you pull an auto, you're likely to pull a numbered card with it. Can't really beat that value from a blaster. Let's get through the base cards. We got a red of Alante Taylor. Patty Mahomes on the ovation. I love these checkerboards. We got the Thrillers, Chris Olave. And KR on the back. Keep her going here. Base cards for days. We got a red Patty Mahomes. Cooper Cup. 
Lamar and Nicobe Dean on the back. For our last pack of rookies and stars. Got base cards for days. We got a red of Montrell Washington, Kayvon, Kenneth Walker, and Kyle Kyle Phillips on the back. So it's gonna do it for rookies and stars. Can't really complain with those pulls. Pulling an auto and another num bonus numbered card. Set this out the way. Let's move on to some Donruss Holiday. I'm going to shimmy this camera down a little so we can see a little better. All right, let's, uh, let's keep her rolling. We're going to try our luck with Donruss Holiday now. Maybe pull a nice downtown. I have not pulled a single downtown this year from Donruss Football. It's probably been my least favorite rip out of all, all of them, to be honest. All right, so we got six total packs, 15 cards in each pack, so you guys can get a good look at what you can pull here. You can pull rookie holiday sweaters that are numbered, but that's it for numbered cards. You cannot pull autographs. So pretty tough pulls in these products, and these blasters. You can pull downtowns, but good luck. All right, so we got a Kenneth Walker on the rookies. With Quay Walker and Brees Hall on the back. It's a nice, nice uh, Kenneth Walker. Alright, let's skip through the base as fast as we can. We have a Kenny Pickett on the White Hot Rookies. Kenny Pickett base. And Dotson on the back. So it's not often actually pulling the quarterbacks is really tough. So even though they're just base, that's actually a nice little surprise. Pulling two Kenny Pickett's in one pack. You do the cool part about these boxes is you get an optic rated rookie parallel per box, which is really nice. We've got a gridiron Kings Jonathan Taylor. Boy Mafe. Uh, and Tyrone Price. I wonder if we'll pull a Purdy in this review. You also get a jersey card. I think we got... Yeah, our jersey card is going to be in here. We got a Brady. Our jersey card is going to be Traylon Burks. It's like a rookie sweater. Got Fedarian Mathis and Ahmad Sauce Gardner on the back. Can never complain with pulling sauce. All right, we'll skip through the base as always. We've got a power plus of Tua. Greg Dulcich rookie and Khalil Shakir. And for our last pack of Donruss, we will get the optic back there as you guys can see. Looks like 49ers colors back there. That'd be really nice. Pulling a Purdy. All right. Yeah, it's for the Buccaneers. We're looking at Rashad White. We also had Christian Harris. And yeah, so that is going to do it for the Donruss box. I mean, we did pull some nice Kenny Pickett's, but that's why I'm not a real big fan of Donruss. Just a ton of base cards. So... Let's keep her moving, kind of, we'll, we'll uh, I don't really want to go back to back Don Russ, so we'll move on to Illusions. Product I honestly did not open too much of. I'm not really a big fan of Illusions. You can pull the Hollow Heroes, but that's really it. You can pull numbered cards to 125, and it does not look like you can pull autographs. Oh, yeah, Ricky signs orange. Okay, you can pull autographs, so fingers crossed we can pull something nice. <clears throat> Let's test our luck out on Illusions Football. All right, we got Aaron Donald to start it off. I do like the base designs for these cards. Got Tua, 
How about a Kenny Pickett to start us off? And a green Mike Evans. Not a bad way to start it off, though, with a Kenny P. Pulling a lot of Pickett in this video. All right, Najee, JT, Kamara, a lot of running backs. Javante, David Montgomery, all running backs. And then Vilas Jones. This is the Dots Parallel. Obviously looks gorgeous. All right, we got Russ, rookie Kenneth Walker. Trevor Lawrence, Wentz, and we got two acetate cards. We're looking at green, Stefan Diggs, and Desmond uh, Ritter, king of cards on the back. Do like acetate cards. We're halfway through this illusion box. Got King Henry, TJ Watt, got Trayvon Walker, rookie, and <laughs> green mill punter on the back. With two packs left to go, we still have not seen anything, really. We got Josh Allen, Mac Jones, Zeke, Carr, Fields, and a green Matt Stafford. Yeah, if you don't pull an auto or a numbered card or the um, Hollow Heroes, then Illusions is just a rough rip. We got Olave, Leonard Fournette. We got, looks like a Galactic or something back there. Kyler Murray, Joe Mixon, we got Davis Mills, looks like a galactic parallel, not numbered, but looks filthy, and then Kyle Hamilton on the back, so pretty rough box from Illusions as well, that's why I don't open too much Illusions, let's keep her going, let's move on to Prestige. Prestige is always a fun rip. Well, I can't say always a fun rip, but this year they made Prestige really fun. You get one numbered card per box, as far as I know. Every box I've opened has had a numbered card. A lot of autographs in these boxes. Look at all the stuff you can pull. So fingers crossed, Prestige can come save the day. Six packs per box. I've had boxes where I pulled an auto plus two bonus numbered cards for a total of three numbered cards. So you can pull tons of nice stuff in these boxes. Let's get Purdy to make an appearance. We got Brees Hall, Chris Godwin on the diamond parallel. And then some base vets to end her off. I think you get five of these diamond parallels per box. Really sharp looking cards. Moving along, we got Tua. Oh, we got a backwards card back there. Um, is it an auto? I don't know. Find out here. Oh, we do get an auto. Trey Hendrickson, too. Number 21 of 99. That's why I say don't sleep on Prestige, man. What an awesome retail pull. Nice. So we got a nice, another autograph. Let's check out the rest of that pack. Did have a diamonds of Ramadre Stevenson, Desmond Ritter, Carson Palmer, and uh, great, great start to this box. Could get at some more numbered parallels as well. All right. Let's keep it rolling. We got base vets for days. We do got a Cleo Mack Diamond Parallel. Likely. Oh, another numbered card. Snuck right on us. 92 of 449 of Eli Mitchell. That's why I love, love these Prestige Blasters, man. Such an underrated rip. We got, we're still halfway through this box. All right, let's get through the base cards as always. We have a Keenan Allen, Kair. Oh my goodness, another numbered card of Jamar Chase this time. It's going to be numbered 91 of 249. 
We're averaging a numbered card per pack right now. We're really taking, we'll really take a Jamar numbered card too. Number 91 of 249. We still got a couple more packs to go here. Here's all the rest of our base cards and our two packs remaining. If we pull another numbered card, then I have noticed all the corners on these cards are just wrecked. Every pack's been like that. But still, it's been fun. We got Jamar, Easy E, James Cook, Matt Ryan, and some more base vets. All right, our last pack of Prestige. Prestige came with the fire, man. It's going to be hard to beat Prestige. We have a Keenan Allen franchise favorites, not numbered. Cooper Cup, Sauce Gardner. We had a Logan Hall on the Diamonds. And then some base vets to end it off. So very nice, very, very nice blaster from Prestige. Let's go. We have three boxes left. Let's go over to... Let's do Zenith. Maybe pull us a nice auto or a nice mem. Or a nice just card in general. I do love the inserts in Zenith. All right. Let's keep her moving. Got six packs. Feels like this pack's thick. We might have a jersey card right here. Yeah, we got a jersey card. In these boxes, you get one auto or memorabilia per box. All right, we got Max Crosby. Our jersey card is going to be Hassan Haskins. Then we had Tyler Algier, rookie, and McCaffrey of the Z Stars insert on the back. Don't have any of my jersey card sleeves down here. All right, we got Dak, Matt Ryan, Sam Howell, rookie, and Tyler Smith on the back. We got Jameis Winston, Corey Davis, Quay Walker, and rookie wave of Damian Pierce. See, the inserts in this product are just awesome. Halfway through Xena. Got Pittman, Debo, Kyler Gordon. How about a Tom Brady on the Revolution? Cards on a thicker stock. I love these, love these inserts, man. Very happy to pull Brady. Two packs to go. Got Goff, DJ Moore, Dobbs, and Jalen Tolbert. And last pack of Zenith. Got Dobbins, Ryan, Alec Pierce, and a Debo on the pink no huddle. It's a pretty underwhelming blaster of Zenith there for sure. Let's move on to Mosaic. Appreciate everyone that's still tuned in. If you haven't already, like, comment, subscribe, show some love real quick. Now, Mosaic has a lot to offer. You can pull the Genesis, the Honeycombs, all of the case hits down there. Hopefully it shows out. Last product battle that I had with Mosaic pulled a absolute monster. I think it was a uh, Genesis of christian watson so hopefully we can continue the luck with mosaic it's been an absolute beast of a product all right starting it off with alexander kirk a lot of base cards as i remember got a green justin jefferson thunder lane insert and a base of jonathan taylor on the back we'll skip through the base cards we got brian robinson and a green Reggie Wayne on the back. Um, Bates, ETN. Got a green of LaVisca Chenault on the back that is cut off. You can see kind of has the black that's supposed to be right here up there. Halfway through Mosaic. It's looking dusty. 
We got the all base pack. Like the corners are all messed up on these packs. I don't know. Maybe I grabbed all damage boxes. Kenneth Walker, Mahomes, Mills, Travis Kelsey on the back. Two packs to go. Corners are all messed up here too. Um, we got Sauce Gardner, Logan Thomas, Joe Mixon, and Gibson will to win on the back. And our last pack of Mosaic, who's, which has had a very disappointing showing. Got Goddard, Waller. Uh, we did get a green Trayvon Walker on the back, but that's pretty much it. Very rough, very rough box for Mosaic. And that leaves us down to one more product. We've got the famous old regular Donruss, which does offer better stuff than the holler, the holiday blasters. In these boxes, you can pull the crunch time and the production line inserts. It says on the holiday blasters, you can pull them, but no one has yet. So I think they forgot to put them in there. And our last box of the battle. See how we're going out. See how Donruss wants to treat us. I know there's going to be a lot of base cards. Uh, we got a red of J.C. Horn. And Trayvon Walker. Red rookies on the back. There was also a Tolbert back there. All right. Sorry to skip and buy the base cards if anyone's into those. We've got Robinson, Sam Williams, George Pickens on the rookies. Um, we got DeMarvin Leal, Jerome Ford, and a Tom Brady road to the Super Bowl on the back. Not numbered. Halfway through Donruss. Looks like we're going out with... We have Tyler Linderbaum. Jermaine Johnson. Am I Mr. Rookie in there? No. Alright, we got two more packs to go. And this is a, I'm just really not a fan of Donruss. Like there's really... I got a jersey card back there. I was wondering what was going on. All right, we got Desmond Ritter, Daxton Hill. Got a Garrett Wilson on their jersey card, rookie phenom. All right, so at least we got a hit. And our last pack of the video. See, this is what I don't like about this product. Why is the last card in the pack backwards? So at least... We didn't really get much here. Isaiah Spiller and Taylor. Save all the base cards. All right. And that is going to do it for this video. Let's do a little recap of all of the products. We'll start with Donruss since it's right in front of us. Donruss, we did pull the Garrett Wilson. We did get a handful of other rookies. Nice George Pickens. But that is really it from Donruss. Best pull was the Garrett Wilson. By far. Illusions football. Didn't really pull a whole lot either. Pulled some nice acetate inserts, Trayvon Walker, and our best pull was the Kenny Pickett base. From Zenith, also didn't really deliver the way I was hoping. Pulled a nice Tom Brady Revolution insert. That was pretty much it. Prestige, on the other hand, Prestige came through and delivered big time. Pulled all of this nice stuff. We got an Eli Mitchell out of 449. How about a autograph out of 99 of Trey Hendrickson plus uh, um, Jamar Chase out of 249. So tons of stuff from Prestige. That's why I always hype this product up. Mosaic definitely underperformed. Our best pull was this green Trayvon Walker. Here's a good look at everything else. Pretty underwhelming showing for Mosaic. Holiday Donruss. We pulled the two Kenny Pickett's and that was really it. For Donruss Elite Football, pulled some pretty decent stuff. Got some nice Spellbounds, 
and a number David Bell out of 449. Prism. Prism actually really hooked us up, if I remember correctly. We got the Romeo Dobbs Silver, Sean Taylor, 900 points, and a Pacheco rookie. So Prism definitely did not disappoint. Rookies and Stars. I think this is our last product for you guys to remember. We got Chris Olave. Got the Drake Jackson out of 80. And a autograph of Jeremy Ruckert. So that is going to do it for this product battle. You guys, again, have to comment below which product you think performed the best and which product out of all of these boxes is your favorite. Me, personally, my favorite product this year is probably this product right here. Rookies and Stars. So that is going to do it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, you know what to do. Show some love as always. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and get qualified for the giveaway. The link is down in the description below. And peace out.